rough to the gym. Brittany doesn't usually go that much to the gym, but she wanted to do it with me. So it's great. Ready for the gym? I'm pumped to be here today, everybody. I just, I just said, you don't usually go, but. Here I am. So what do you got going on here? Gym was good. It was small, but well equipped. There's like two bikes, two ellipticals, I think a rower and two treadmills, and then some like machinery. It's hot in there. It was small. And we just brought some like um, protein packets from Costco. And I think we're gonna go have a little breakfast now, and hopefully it clears up. It's a little cloudy right now. I cannot decide, cause I'm sober tonight. just finally getting around to taking a dip in our little plunge pool here. We just finished up breakfast over at Irina's and it's the same as the room service menu. So whichever you prefer, I had the same exact thing as yesterday. I thought it was equally as great. It was great from room service. It was great over at the restaurant. Everything was good. It's a little overcast right now. The sun peaks out and then the clouds come. It's still nice and warm. We have the cooking class um, in about two hours or so, and we're just gonna sort of soak up the warmth and uh, see what we can get ourselves into. So it is 9.50 a.m. No one down here, no chairs saved, nothing like that. It's not like that at all here. Now we're going to put the, you know, start to the slices of 
this can be any fish, salmon, yeah, any any fish that is damaged, uh, right? Next course. Beef carpaccio, my favorite. It's included, not an extra fee. We actually go into the kitchen with Chef Marco and Chef Alex. Today we did beef carpaccio and homemade gnocchi, and everything was incredible. And I'm not just saying this, but the beef carpaccio was the best I ever had, and I love beef carpaccio. Do not miss it, this is the yeah, best delicious. thing that I've done. We just got all packed up. We are moving over to a Villa 15. Um, nothing is wrong with our room. We actually like our room very much. We get gorgeous sunrises over here. We were just looking for something that has a little more afternoon sun because we are pool people and um, a villa in the sun happened to open up. So they had us tour it and we said we liked it. So we just packed um, all of our stuff up. We are waiting for Daryl, our ambassador, to come collect us in the bags and we will show you our new room. All right, here's our new room. The layout is a little bit different. Um, closets. Bathroom. Gorgeous, sunny, sunny pool. I'm sure we will be burnt to a crisp now. So the um, patio in this room is a little bit bigger. So same thing, you have your liquor bottles, mini fridge, just gorgeous. And um, Daryl, the ambassador, says we're going to have gorgeous sunsets from over here. So I'm really excited. Like you used to be. Thank you so much. What you got? I got like a rum punch. I have my Starburst drink and a Malibu drink. You look set. What? You look set. Yeah. So we switched rooms and we're finally back in the pool. It didn't take too long, but uh, it's a beautiful day. Waiting for a drink. We're waiting for some drinks. I don't know what we ordered because they kind of just like bring us whatever. So I'm getting a little hungry actually. It's 2.20. 
I think I might get some spicy tacos for lunch that's on the menu today and see where that takes us. We got some mystery drinks with the rum, good as always. We got some lunch coming out. We ordered some tacos. We got some drinks. This one tastes like a Starburst. I don't know what it is. Something with rum. And then a PSA to everyone, myself included. This is an English speaking country. English. I am telling everyone. Hola, I'm going Papa Fritas, gracias. Like, I'm just not with it. I'm just so used to my Mexican roots, but speak English. Yeah. Want to do the unveiling? I'll do the unveiling. They bring the food right to you. It's a heavy box, I gotta say. Tacos. Woo! And the other one's the same. So what'd you think of your lunch? Tacos? I thought it was great. I've been impressed by all the food. Like you can tell like food is like another level here and they really take a lot of pride in it and I love to eat so I'm happy with the upgraded food experiences. How about you? I think they're also good, um, delicious, and the service here is just impeccable, so that's it. and it's like bath water because it's just always heated by the sun. Oh, so nice. So it's almost six and our pool's still sunny. So the sun is gonna set right over here. I think it's gonna be so gorgeous tonight. So tonight's the seven course dinner and I'm so excited for that. Everyone says it's delicious. So did a little fancier of a dress tonight. And dinner reservations at 7.30 again. So we're gonna get a cocktail beforehand and go over and see what the seven courses is about. to the Irina's bar before dinner because our new room is right next to that bar and our old bar was next to the rum bar, the nobody knows bar. So we were planning to do Irina's and then the rum bar and then go to dinner, but I don't think we're gonna have enough time. Dinner's in an hour. However, everything is on island time and that's not a bad thing, but ordering a drink they really craft it with love. So you don't just get a drink right away. It's It could take us an hour, you know, to get the one drink and sip on it and the whole thing. So I don't think we'll be able to hit up two bars in an hour, but we shall see. bars right up there and that's where we had breakfast this is you know kind of the lobby area it's not a big resort
We'll still be up, still be up. Don't care about the place we found. We'll still be up, still be up. We're in this together. We both fall down. Doesn't matter if the sun goes up. Cause we will still be high when the time. Seven courses tonight on the Caribbean Mai Tai. Brittany's got her walnut, watermelon mint. Mojito, and it's so good. And I've been saying that the mint here is delicious. Like from the first day, I'm like, it's great. They grow it right next door at the Veranda Resort. And you can tell, like it's so fresh, it's delicious. Love it. first initial reaction of seeing the portions you're like oh am I gonna need to get something afterwards but I'm totally full I really liked it a lot I think it's a fun experience that we probably would never do at home and I think you definitely should book this if you are coming here and we'll ask Kevin what he thinks because my palate is a little more adventurous than his so let's see what he thinks I thought it was good um, the lobster which lobster pasta which I don't love I did like it was very good. Um, Brittany's favorite. Um, that what was the fish with the yeah the Dorado, Dorado curry. Or, and like really either no. 
um, but everything else was good. Um, so what was your favorite? Uh, <clears throat> probably, I don't know, like the pasta, I mean, that stands out. Mm -hmm. And your least favorite would be the fish curry? Yes, the fish curry. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> At our nightcap here, I ordered a uh, dessert drink. I told Andre over here at the bar a dessert drink, and he got put everything in there. How was it? I didn't even try. Good. Mm, good. What's it taste? What? What are the flavors? Like chocolate and amaretto for sure. Mm -hmm. I think it's good. All right, we're gonna end day three right here. Come back really soon for day four. Tomorrow we are going to Shirley Heights to see the sunset, so hopefully it's a nice clear night. Really excited about that because from what I've seen online, the views are just gorgeous. And what I will say is the resort is sold out and you would not know it. Like no, no you no. like rarely see anyone. The staff is just so accommodating. It's been just awesome. We're having a really great time. So thanks so much for watching. Subscribe if you're new and we will see you really soon.